success. Welcome back to Poor Shark's Happy Life. Thanks for joining us today. In today's broadcast, we're going to do a DIY transformation of Annabelle's old easel. She's had this easel for a few years, but she's a big girl now, right? So we transformed her bedroom, her little girl bedroom, into a big girl bedroom because now she's how old? Six years old. Six years old. So we're, we didn't want to get rid of this because it comes in handy and we think it'll come in handy during the school year when she's in what grade? First grade. First grade, yeah. So, but what we don't like about it is the color. The red and the orange uh, colors kind of clash with her new colors because her new bedroom colors are, what kind of colors do you have in your bedroom? Um, I have white, gold, mm -hmm. and gray. Gray, and then we have black, right? Yeah. So we got a bunch of contemporary colors. Yes. Um, so yeah, um, what we're gonna need is this bucket here, right, Belle? Yeah, and we got a bunch of stuff in here. I cannot be able to hold it. <laughs> okay, do you wanna tell, let's start with, what's, what's this? We have some soap because we're gonna have to wash this. Yeah, we're gonna have to wash all, you know, on the other side is a chalkboard. So we're gonna yeah. have to wash anything that's on there, anything that has like a waxy buildup, we're gonna have to make sure that's we've gotten rid of that, right? And we're gonna yeah. also need what? We're gonna need some sponges. To go with the soap, right? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Okay, pull that one out. And we got some white gloves and we have two because you always need this until you're gonna spray um, something with paint. Yeah, so we don't get our hands dirty, right? Yeah. We don't wanna spray yeah, paint our fingers. Yeah, because if you have something that cannot come off, and you get it on your skin, it's gonna be horrible. Right, yeah. Okay, yeah, so, so we what do we got here next? And we're gonna use two because we're both gonna use it. Yep. And what we got next? We need to cover we got up some boots. any of the dry eraser board, right? Yeah. And and on the other side, the, um, the chalkboard so that we don't get paint on it. Yeah, I scribbled on it when I was two years old. Yep, okay, what else we got? We got? I got pink hot glue gun and it has a new cord in the back. Yeah, of so we're gonna use the hot glue gun. Yep. Um, that's gonna be used to use. Yep. We are gonna use some shiny sparkles. Yeah, some little gems, some rhinestones yeah. that we're gonna use to decorate yeah, it. Some little and in addition gems. to that, we've got some sequins, right? Yep, sequins. Some, some gold have, sequins, so just to add a little yeah, bit of color. Gray and gold sequins to add a little color, my mom said. Okay, and then we have we have clothespins and we have some magnets. Yep. And we're gonna use those so she can display her artwork during the year, right? Yeah, and we find these at the dollar stores. Yeah. Um, actually, no, we found some of the stuff at the dollar store, but a lot of the stuff at the craft store at Michaels. Yeah. And then, not, last but not least, we've got our we got our paint. We need black paint. And what's the other color? Gold paint. Hopefully. And gold paint it comes out good. Okay. So, let's get started! Now we have went ahead and taped both of our sides of our easel, the chalkboard side and the dry uh, erase board side with painter's tape. So that's gonna allow us to um, spray paint without damaging the center of the easel. And we also took the tray off that holds the middle of the easel together. So now it's the fun part, right Belle? Spray paint. We get to spray paint.
So now our paint has dried on both sides and we're ready to what? We're ready to sparkle. Ready to sparkle. So Anvil has some rhinestones. We yeah. gotta give them a, show them what they look like. Okay, and I've got some sequins. We've got some gold and some silver. And so all you're gonna need is a hot glue gun and make sure adults, you supervise your children doing this, um, adults should use the hot glue gun. And we're just gonna go ahead and add the sparkle to our easel. 